Good morning, everybody. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my world. This is The World Away. Today, I'm going to be doing the next six stages. That's stages 33 to 38 of the D'Agostini Collectibles release and build the International Space Station. And we get to play that favourite game of mine, is which is Name That Part, because I haven't got a clue. They just refer to the parts in here as details, and it is great having the community actually telling me what I'm actually building today. Now, this is where we're up to at the moment. Actually, let's bring this over and do it justice because it is quite heavy. But look, this is so far where we are up to. Looking good, isn't it? <laughs> if you want to get this for yourself, I'll put a link in the video description and there's also a QR code on the screen. This is what we created in the last pack. So we are going to be building onto this today. So without further ado, let's get cracking. So here you go, here's stage 33 and the magazine here, full of all knowledge about space and space stations that you can shake a stick at. And as you can see, we're going to be doing uh, the next stages here, looking like this. So by the end, that's how it's looking. And here's the parts here for stage 33. So to start off with, I'm going to take these two sections here, piecing them together, and I'm going to be holding them together. I miss these screws with our favourite ass screws. Or if you're American, your ass screws. <laughs> Let's screw these in, we need two of these. Now bringing over what we created in the last pack, looking like this, I'm gonna be putting this over this section here, probably best on the top camera, making sure that fits quite flush in there, like that. And then I've got this piece here, which is differentiated by all the rest of them here because this has got a round base. One of them's got a round base with a tab, One's got a tab facing forward, and one's a square base. So it's the round one that I want. That's going to go on top of this section, just like that there. Once again, held in with an AS5 screw. <laughs> and next to that one, I've got this one, looking like that. That's going to go right next to it. Again, with these details here on top, held in with an AS5 screw. I think I've reached my limit about how many times I can say the word AS5. <laughs> then I've got the squarish looking one. It's got a squarish end. That's going on there like that. Screw that one in. Which means finally we've got this one here, which is slightly off center, going into that one once again. AS5 screw to screw that in. Once they're in nice and tight, I get to put the top on. This is what the top looks like. It's going to go on this way, fit flush over the top of these. Perfect. And once again, AS5 screws, two of these to hold this into place. One there and one here. And I'm sure someone in comments is going to tell me exactly what I'm building here because I haven't got a clue. Perfect. Now I've got this little, what looks like, a satellite dish or something there that's going to be going into just like we did at this side here the hole on this side now it is a d-shaped pattern so it's only going to let you put it in one way but there you go that's in like that bring over the space station and it's basically this side here that i want because this is gonna go over the top, just like this there. And it's held in with MS4 screws. We need two of them. Supporting it for the underside as I screw this in. That's perfect. And as you can see here, that's all there is to do in that stage. So here's stage 34. And this is what the magazine is looking like. And we're going to be adding now this large section here now with an arm by the look of it that we're going to be screwing into place onto this bracket. So that's looking like that. Not much to do in this one. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to bundle that with stage 35. This is stage 35 here. Again, here's the magazine. Excellent. 
And again, we've got these pieces here, which we're gonna be putting together just like this. So now that's looking just like that there. So here's the parts for stage 34. And as we just saw in those stages, we're not actually gonna be using that piece at the moment, but this is metal. The pieces we do need look like this. Now at the moment, we're meant to be putting this bit into this back bracket, but as you can see, it's already been put in for us. That was handy. Uh, but we are gonna screw it in from the other side just with a AS5 screw. I almost referred to it as its other name <laughs> then. I do get penalized by saying that word too many times, so that's why I'm being very careful. Perfect, so that's in. That is still able to move, as you can see. Excellent. And that's all there is to do in that stage. So put that to one side, bring over stage 35, which as you can see has got these other parts in here. They're both metal. So when I bring these both together like this, I'm just gonna clip them in, there you go. We're gonna be screwing them together with two screws here. These are the MS4 screws, looking like this. One in here, and one in the other side. Then all that's left to do then is we're gonna be hiding these screw holes by putting these caps in, making sure we put the right one in. So there is one that's got a notch in it, as you can see, which is gonna go down the notch on this side. It's just a push in, which means this one can only go one way. It's gonna be going on this side there. That hides the screws. That's all there is to do in that stage. In stage 36, here's the magazine, looking like this. And we've got a large area here where we're gonna be attaching what we just created on top of that, including that arm there, putting this actually on top of the space station. So by the end, it's looking like that. So once again, here's all the parts for stage 36. Now this has got a D-shaped pattern on it. So when we put this sec top section in, it can only go in one way. Just wiggle that into position. Perfect. Does take some pushing to get that in there. I need an MS4 screw to hold that in and get that nice and tight. Perfect. That's how that's looking. I want to take the arm piece and putting it in this way. It's just going to be pushing in like that. I need to bring over the space station. And this is gonna be fitting on top, just like this here. Clips in, as you can see, and we're gonna have MS4 screws in the four positions here to hold that in. So I'll get all these in. Excellent, they're all in. Now, once again, we've got caps to put over these. Now, these caps do have notches in them as well. So as you can see, this notch is right in the center, so this can only go in one place. So this is gonna go in here. Then we've got some notches, which has just got a notch just off center here. So that's gonna go in here. And I'm just gonna continue that all the way around. And there you go, on the side camera there, they're all in place. That's all there is to do in that stage. In stage 37, here's the magazine, looking just like this. And we've got a couple of bits here that we're putting in. As a matter of fact, there's not much we're going to be doing. We're just going to be putting this onto the space station, screwing it down, and again, putting these caps on. So I think for the last two stages, I will bundle them together. So we've got, again, stage 38 here. This is the last stage. Here's the magazine. And in the last stage, looks like we've got some trim. I've got a sticker here to put on. So we're going to be adding the trim to the base here. Just like that, it looks like we've got a little sticker here to put onto place as well. Okay, let's do this. So again, every time you see one of these silver bits here, it is solid metal. It's very heavy as well. So I'll open the MS4 screws up ready, bring over the space station, because this time we're working on just this area here. It's gonna go in this way, just over the top. and pushing that into place just like this. Now it's gonna be held in with three of these MS4 screws. So one right down the center here, 
and then two on this edge. And that is perfect. So when that's in place, it should look just like that. As you can see, I've minimized any seam along the side there. But once again, we do have some caps to put in and they can only go in one way again. They've got notches which dictate which way around they go. And then the last one to put in looks just like this. We have got a flatter area on this side. So that's gonna go on that ledge there and that's gonna hide that center screw as well. Put that to one side, because that is the end of that stage. And I'm just gonna be opening up the last stage here we've got in this pack. And we do have these little plastic trim panels. I've got three of these. And these are gonna just go into the holes that we've got just at the bottom, as you can see, of each one of these here. I'm gonna do this one first. It's just a case of pushing them in. So one there, one there, and one there. Now I'm guessing in future stages, we're gonna have more of these to uh, just push in. Now I did think this was a decal. It's not, it's actually a sticker. So that does allow me to hold it there in my tweezers. And to put this in, I'm gonna to have to take this off what we've got here because it actually goes hopefully on the top camera, just next to this NASA sign here. So it's gonna go on that way, just there. So let me get this in and I'll show you what that looks like. And I don't know if you can see that, but there we go, that's in position there. As a matter of fact, it probably just needs a little tiny bit of straightening. Perfect. Okay, I'm gonna put this back on the stand. Excellent. And I did have a cap fall out, so I'm going to glue this cap in now so it doesn't do that again. Oops. Just here. Perfect. Now, we do have this part left over, which we're not to put in at this time, so I'm going to save that till next time. But that's all there is to do in that stage. That's all there is to do in that pack. And once again, I'm going to show you exactly how that's now looking. Pretty cool, huh? <laughs> Once again, if you want to get this for yourself, I've put a link in the video description and a QR code on the screen, but really hope you like that video. If you did, please remember to give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, please, please, please click that bell icon. You'll be notified when the next video comes out and click the subscribe button too. Other than that, take care.